Big weekend for graduations and many students heading off to college afterward, but others will go straight into the workforce. KQ2's Mitchell Riberall speaking with four high school graduates who are jumping straight into the job market. As high school seniors graduate and say goodbye to high school, some will head off to college, while others jump right into the workforce. Then I heard about the apprenticeship and how I just did that. Um, there was two years of this welding technology and I completed that and then I did an interview and I, how it started as I job shadowed the first year there and then now this year I just, I just started working part time. Students like Olivia Carriger and Caden Waterman were able to secure jobs before graduation. I would have started earlier, but because of COVID, I, I started a little bit later than I was supposed to. I have a lot of experience. I was kind of worried maybe someone else applied and they have more experience than me. I'm just the kid that won't get the job, but Scott, Scott gave me the job, and I thank you for that. And they're already experiencing the differences from high school to adulthood. Big change from going to class and just doing teenage kid things to waking up six going to work at seven work until 4 30 or 5. it's a big change having to do big boy things but and for those who are waiting until after graduation say hilliard tech is helping prepare them for that moment of finding a full-time job and it's been really nice they've helped me with even offering just these courses to be able to do it while in high school and just knocking basically two birds out with one stone um, I do think it'll be a lot, but I also think this year really prepared me since I had to do my firefighting and EMT all in one year. Lydia Greer and Jackson Sherlock, training in firefighting and EMT, had to take all their training tests in the same year due to COVID-19 restrictions, causing for an extra workload this year. Very stressful, uh, basically doing double the work just because COVID kind of prevented us from doing our tests from last year. While the school year was tough, the staff say they are proud of the seniors for finishing strong. And the students, they are ready to get to work. It feels so good. I am really proud of myself that I graduated from technical school and high school. Um, and I'm really excited to go find a full-time job. Reporting in St. Joseph, Mitch Riberall, KQ2 News. Next year, Cameron High School will be added as the 19th feeder school with Hilliard Tech, allowing students from there to take their programs.